With over a thousand research studies conducted on creatine, it has been scientifically established as a safe and effective supplement for enhancing muscle growth and strength. However, it's crucial that you understand the proper way to use it to maximize its benefits and avoid unnecessary expenses. In this video, I'll outline four straightforward steps to help you make the most of creatine supplementation. Before delving into the steps, let's briefly explore what creatine is and how it contributes to muscle and strength development. Creatine is a natural substance produced by our bodies and serves as an energy source for powering high-intensity activities lasting around 10 seconds, such as sprints or challenging weightlifting sets. When we supplement with creatine, we can increase our natural creatine levels by approximately 30%. This increase, maintained through consistent supplementation, has been demonstrated to significantly enhance power and strength during workouts, ultimately leading to greater muscle growth. Step 1. Choose the right type of creatine. When you visit a supplement store, you'll encounter various forms of creatine, each claiming unique benefits, such as improved absorption or enhanced effects. However, recent research, including a 2021 systematic review, shows that different forms of creatine are equally effective in boosting muscle creatine levels. Plain creatine monohydrate, the most affordable option, performs just as well as more expensive alternatives. Companies often market proprietary formulas to justify higher prices, but these claims don't hold up against plain creatine monohydrate. To ensure you're making the right choice, check the nutritional label, and the only ingredient should be creatine monohydrate. Step 2. Determine the appropriate dosage. Research indicates that very low doses of creatine, 1 to 2 grams per day, are insufficient to produce significant benefits, while the common 5 gram daily dose may be excessive for most individuals. Studies suggest that a dose of around 3 grams per day is adequate for most people, providing substantial benefits. Heavier individuals may consider a slightly higher dose based on their body weight. Step 3. Loading versus Non-Loading Protocol When starting creatine supplementation, you can choose between two protocols, loading and non-loading. The loading protocol involves taking 20 grams of creatine, 5 grams 4 times a day, for about a week to quickly saturate your muscles before reducing the dose to 3 grams per day. The non-loading protocol consists of a steady 3-gram daily dose from the beginning, gradually increasing your muscle creatine levels over 3-4 to four weeks. Both protocols yield the same results, so your choice should depend on your preference for rapid effects or long-term consistency. The loading protocol can cause digestive discomfort when taking a high dose at once, but this can be mitigated by splitting the dose throughout the day. Step 4. Timing Creatine doesn't produce immediate effects, so taking it as part of a pre-workout supplement isn't necessary. Research even suggests that taking creatine after a workout may be slightly more effective than before. While some evidence suggests that combining creatine with carbohydrates and protein enhances saturation levels, this primarily matters during the initial phase of saturation. The most critical aspect is taking creatine consistently every day at a time that suits your routine. One potential consideration is the interaction between caffeine and creatine. Some studies suggest that caffeine consumption, especially equivalent to 2 to 3 cups of coffee a day, may diminish the benefits of creatine. If you're concerned about this interaction, you can either reduce regular caffeine intake or avoid consuming creatine and caffeine simultaneously. In summary, creatine monohydrate is a valuable supplement when used correctly. Follow the loading or non-loading protocol to saturate your muscles, then maintain with a daily dose of around 3 grams, monitor your progress and adapt as needed. Remember that creatine is not a magic solution, but when combined with proper training and nutrition, it can provide a performance edge. Thank you guys for watching. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. If you have any questions or clarifications on what was covered in the video, please feel free to drop me a comment below.